Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the new safe hour jumping in again and we unfortunately lost our streak in the last episode It is what it is uh, this time around. Let's go as Tainted Blue Baby I've not done stuff as him in ages and while we're not on a streak I feel like it's the best possible time to play him. We do start with an early planetarium Of course, we do have the Isaac champions version of him, but I'm gonna play a regular version for now uh, We start with chocolate um, and the giganta bean so kind of interesting the giganta bean thing can be a little iffy um but starting with the chocolate's pretty good, especially if you can somehow make it gold, because the golden version of it drops golden poops, which makes it kind of amazing. There's not many things you can use to make a trinket gold, but there is a few here and there um, that we could potentially get some use out of. God, it's a very, very bad hit. Now remember, we do not get cheaper devil deals as this character. I constantly forget that, and it gets me screwed over all the damn time. I'm hoping we can get a key here for that planetarium. If we don't, I'm going to be a little upset. Um, and I have a feeling I know what the game's going to do. Because it likes to do it. It really does. Ooh, dude. Okay, that makes that way better. Okay, that's that's good to know. Right, I'll try and uh, get a secret room with this next one here. Right, let's have a little look. So, so secret room's probably likely to be here, right? Uh, to the left of this. Yeah. Good, 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 because this is a higher chance for a key. Still, good chance for a key. Or an item. Either or, either or. Uh, we get pop, which I'm unsure exactly the timing on this here. Okay, this is going to be tricky. Yeah. Oh, dude, this is going to be well hard. Oh, my God. I, I do want pop because it's, it's not bad. Okay, I got hit twice. It's good enough. <laughs> it's good enough. Okay, yeah. Not not ideal. Not the best, but there you go. As for the question of the day to day, um hmm. What's um who who's a person that you've been like that you've not contacted in a while that you now remember that you definitely should? <laughs> okay, we do, we do have the ability to get a key here at least. I'm just reminding people that there's someone that you haven't spoken to that you need to message. <laughs> Surely. Okay, good stuff. So yeah, now we can do this and get a key at least. So we can see what our planetarium holds for us. If it's Mars, or if it's Sol, I swear to God, I will hold R. Because <laughs> every goddamn time. It's one of those. What about the modded ones? What about all the ones that are truly amazing? Come on now. Don't screw me this time. Don't screw me. Oh, baby. Oh, not even remotely screwed. I don't really like how I look with the icy poopy going on. It's it's a little horrible looking. I will definitely grab this. And we'll continue forth. With this intriguing run of freezy eyes. I like it. I love it. I'm going to hold that for now. And we'll see what we can get done with the rest of these poopies. Ah, oh, bugger you, you stupid earth. Dude, those, those are like so strong now with the giganta bean smelted. I like it. Yeah, nice. But yeah, going to be taking a lot of damage with this guy. It just kind of happens. Nice little freeze on you, especially enemies that spread into more enemies. You want to be freezing those kind. Lovely stuff. Bit of extra there. Boss coming our way any second here. Oh my god. Can I stop taking dumb damage? I don't know why, but Blue Baby is a character I find really difficult. Let's wait until we've got three blue flies here, then we'll uh, do this. Which didn't really work the way I wanted it to, but hey her. Okay. You could move yourself, good sir. Didn't quite work the way I wanted it to, but overall not terrible. Right, we got that. Right, what we got going on completion mark wise? We've got quite a lot to do here. We'll probably want to go Mega Satan and regular path by the looks of it. Um, light path seems to be the best way forward. Good old Mega Satan. Nice. We yeah. are. Yeah, the chocolate bar can be kind of good. I do like it. 
Like I said, if we can get it gold, it becomes a lot better. Hmm. Yes, baby. That's pretty worthwhile. Mapping and a soul heart, or potential for a soul heart. You can get air uh, cards as well, but I'd say that's pretty good going. I'm pretty happy with that. Good, good. And then item room. All oh, item room holds a good item as well. Beautiful stuff. Beautiful stuff. You know what? Let me just clear a few of these out. Just so I can do this. Ah, come on now. How dare you. Okay, but yeah, I'm very, very happy the item we just got there. Um, bit of extra damage and scaling extra damage as we... Um... Oh, very nice. Okay, this is... this is looking. Things are looking good right now. Things are looking good. But yeah, having knockback on these is, is interesting. I see you up there. Right. Secret room, good. We can get into the cash room as well for free if we get another bomb. Good stuff. Glass D12, I don't really know how I feel about that. Ooh. Infinite keys is good because we can go back to the uh, thingy. We haven't got... Uh, oh, no, we have got boss rush and stuff. So we don't we don't have, have to speed along too quickly here, which is very, very nice to see. Right, what you got for us? Ah. Uh, I think this is actually a good D12 room. Um... I mean, I guess we could try for... Eh, we don't really want Petrified Poop, do we? So this, this room's kind of a bust. Unfortunate, but it is what it is. But yeah, I thought m most chance of getting like a Golden Poop or something from the D12 there. Um, we've not got another bomb available quite yet. We'll wait on that until we can get into the cash room for free. We'll wait until we're in the big room to use the, the fart here, because having that coming up is good stuff. Nice. Yeah, we want to get ourselves into a populated area and just go boom. <laughs> So goddamn nice. Good, good, good. There's a key. Okay, we still. Do oh no, we do, we do have a bomb. We do have a bomb. Well, we have a, we have an impromptu bomb. Not the way I, I prefer to make these concoctions because it can be a bit dangerous, but it, it works. There you go. And have we got anything of value in here? I mean, charming them too is kind of nice. Torture cookie. Ah, bugger. On you steals half, uh, half a red heart of damage to the player and either displays an evil fortune or spawns a black heart. Spawns a reverse tarot card or spawns an evil themed trinket. I guess I'll hold on to it. Um, can't imagine it being that valuable for us. We're going to go and get another use out of the um, crystal ball in case we get a soul heart. Soul heart or card would be okay with. Obviously, soul heart would be preferred the card. Oh, unfortunately, it's not a very good card. You know what? Oh, you bastard. The fucking short fuse troll bombs get me every time. I'm always like, hey, I can push that troll bomb around before it explodes, and then it's the goddamn short fuse one that blows up on me. And to be fair, I am slower than I thought I was. I thought I was a lot quicker than that, so wasted soul heart for no reason, and got a card that didn't matter and wasted it. So, all, all good in this hood right now. All good in this hood. Okay, these things are taking longer to die than I would have expected. I'm trying to... <laughs> fuck's sake, I'm trying to utilize Euphoria. Oh my god! <sighs> I hate myself. I genuinely hate myself. Stop getting hit! Just because you're playing Tainted Blue Baby doesn't need to need, mean you need to play like an absolute moron. My goodness. I don't know what's wrong with me when I play as this character. I just can't. I get hit so much. Ugh. Annoys me, right? Don't go in there. Right. Let's try and keep this together. Stop trying to use Euphoria. It's goddamn garbage. Stop trying to use it. It's stupid. Never worth it, ever. I'm very angry right now. <laughs> I'm just taking some absolutely moronic damage. It was nice.
I don't know if I can use airwalls to skip this room by creating a crawl space in here or not. Or if it'll just be shut. I'm really not sure. But I'm not going to take the risk just in case. That didn't do any damage to you. What the hell? Okay. Right, it was um, on here. Hopefully we get something good from here as well. Eh, we got a very good trinket. I mean, I, I like the chocolate, but... This trinket could save our life, so we have to take it. Careful of these big fellas. The knockback can be a little annoying with pop, but I think overall the damage it's gaining us is, is worthwhile. Um, poop here. Oh! I'm gonna... I'm, I'm gonna kill myself. <laughs> I'm getting really fucking frustrated. Oh my god, just stop playing like a goddamn idiot. Now I've got something in my eye. Certainly not helping with not playing like a goddamn idiot. Golden key again. I guess I'll check in here for a soul heart. Thank god it has one, because otherwise I'd be annoyed. I mean, I'm getting pretty lucky that the game's giving me the HP it's giving me right now, because... I do not deserve it. I need more fire rate, I think. Or, or, or maybe it's shot speed I need. My shot speed's pretty bad. Fucking... Hit the cunt! Oh my god! Oh, this is not a good episode, people. This episode is filled, filled with turmoil and sadness, because, oh my god. I'm having a bad time. <laughs> I just... Oh, I can't do it, people. I can't do it. That didn't really work the way I wanted to. That did, though. That was nice. Good. Item room, please give me something extraordinarily beautiful. I don't know how I didn't get hit there, but we didn't, so let's be happy about it. Not dwell. Wait, wait, where is the item room? Oh, I've, I've just missed it. Big old fart for you. Yeah, I think Pop is actually making things a lot harder right now. I think Pop plus this knockback thing is kind of screwing me. I need a lot more shot speed because they're just kind of not reaching the target at all. I'm going to take this pill because I hate myself. Oh, yes, baby. Okay. Game has finally recognized my genius and rewarded it. Okay, that was a fat miss. Get out of here. You can move those poops? Interesting. I didn't think you'd be around. What the hell? Okay, you died pretty quick. That's fine. Okay, it's another active item. Upon you, you become invincible to projectiles. Hold the bag up and start sucking all nearby projectiles for three seconds. When the effect ends, all sucked projectiles are released as homing tears and fired in your direction. And it's definitely better than what we're holding right now, but I'm not exactly sure how valuable this is going to be. Now, question is, would I gamble on a full run reroll at this time? I'm 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 gonna say no, but I'll check anyways. Rerolls all pickups in the room. Well that's kind of a bitch move. Oh wait, no, that doesn't work the way I thought it would. Okay, let's just grab this then. Get out of here. Okay. Back out we go. Yeah, not been super successful thus far. Not been super successful thus far. Let's charge up as much as Euphoria as we can. Try and get 
a bit of a bonus as we enter the room. Go up to max. Gotta let the Euphoria go now. Oh god, I wasn't expecting that. Okay, that was good. This is good. All of this is good right now. Do we have a bomb available? Okay, we do. Good. That's pretty decent. Um... Yeah, fire rate bonus is nice. That's pretty nice. Oh my god. The knockback on that is going to be wild in rooms. My goodness, I don't know if I'm looking forward to that. Right. Good to go. Health is better. We've come out of this okay. I'm not particularly pleased with it, but it's okay. But the, these little... These little tears are going to be kind of wild. <laughs> yeah, I gotta say, it's, it's good to have some level of, like, herming, but it's it's gonna be dangerous because they're just gonna be traveling all over the place. It does seem they adopt our tier effects, though, apart from maybe pop. But yeah, I don't actually have to fire at things anymore. Oh, that hit me. God damn it. I don't really have to actually fire at things anymore. Um, more about just firing in general and letting... Letting this thing do the work. Eventually, it'll kill everything. As you can see, eventually it gets there. Okay, invincible enemies don't don't bond well with this. I'm I'm holding on to fire right now because I have really high fire rate. I think that's increasing the chance at which I fire off these things. Might as well just keep it going, sort of thing. Single penny. No thanks. Yeah, it's, it's pretty powerful. Pretty good item. It's pretty... It, it, it feels a little bit janky, but overall it's good. Okay, that's, that bag's kind of fine. I kind of get why it's tier 1. Uh, unfortunately, the bubbles count as enemies here, so they're going to target the bubbles like crazy. Nice. Ah, you teleported away. Okay. We got the Celestial Crown here, which I think is really good. Tears that pass through. Yeah, this should be pretty good for us. Yes, this is very good for us. Because tears are going to be passing through these crowns all the goddamn time and gaining effects. It's pretty top tier for us, actually. Pretty good. Hold on to that. Fire mines in there. Yeah, I no longer actually aim at enemies. I just hold down the fire button and wait until things die. Got Parasite in there. You're still not dead? What the hell? Dude! Goddamn die! Alright, I let go for a second because I need to change finger. <laughs> that one was hurting. This is beautiful. Okay, we've got Nose Goblin in there as well. Good stuff. Oh, there's a Luck Penny back there, apparently. Let me just go back and grab wherever said Luck Penny is. Thank you. Seen our item room. We're good on that front. Shop, however. I mean, I guess I could buy a Soul Heart. It's always worth buying a Soul Heart. Oh, you made him teeny tiny. So cute. Ooh, tier detonator now. That is a good idea.
Okay, can we get an additional penny from somewhere? Because tier detonator seems like we could really rock the boat with that. I think it could lag our game pretty significantly, but that sounds fun. <laughs> yeah, I think that could be that could be pretty top tier for us right now. If if it splits the tiers that come out of the shotgun style thing, which I'm assuming it will, to be honest. Yes, it does. Now, it doesn't make them into Herming tiers, though, which is not great, but to be expected, to be honest. And obviously, Pop means they hang around a little bit as well, which is nice. This guy's doing big old farts as well. Okay, we got him. Ooh, this is good. Straight up plus two soul hearts. I like that. Right, down we go. We're looking for, what is it, Mega Satan Light Path that we're trying to do this time around? I like this setup we've got going on right now. It's very intriguing. It's very weird, but it's intriguing. <laughs> I love that. The just detonation that you get going on. <laughs> it just spreads them out everywhere. It's great. You guys are probably going to be a bit of a pain in the ass, aren't you? Yeah. This is going to be a major pain in the ass. Luckily, I got the freezing little boys there. Oh, come on. Target this guy, oh, please. Thank you. Took long enough. Holy shit. We need Spectral. Spectral will make this so much better. If we got Spectral, then we'd be able to, like, create a ton of tears that would linger for a while and not just hit rocks. It's kind of like a shotgun-style blast at the minute, where we go up right next to an enemy, fire off the tears, and then immediately detonate them all. It works, but it's not the best. Make sure we kill Shoe Boy. Got him charmed, nice. What we got going on in here? No thank you. There is no world in which I'll ever take a little portal. Oh wait, I have a I have a reroll. I should just reroll it. I kinda forgot I was holding on to this reroll. Okay, let me go back and solo up Eden, that bad boy, because that is an item I will never pick up. Hey, not bad, not bad. Oh, it's shot speed as well, okay. The shot speed bonus is actually the, the more beneficial thing out of the two there, to be honest. The 6.13 T is very, very, very nice. Look at that beautifulness. Amazing. Right, charger up. Make sure we fire in the right direction here. Up to 6.13 again, is it? There you go, 6.13. We're good. We do have two difficult bosses here. Unfortunately, we're probably going to get hit a little bit by at least one of these guys, because there's just a lot going on for us to deal with here. Luckily, our shots are pretty good damn good at hitting everything in the room, regardless of where we are. Just have to be aware that these guys will travel, as you can see. Okay, we've got one of them. Nice. Hey, good old toothpicks. Very, very nice. Okay, fire rate is looking really, really good now. Uh, I think we're just good to go here. Health is looking really good. I mean, this 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 chastity item, whatever it was called, the, the shotgun blast thing, is very, very nice right now. We, we don't have to aim anymore, which is quite nice. I didn't expect that to travel the full length of the room, I'll be honest. Oh, my shots. The ice is like the, the literal icing on the cake, to be honest. It's not necessary, but it is a nice addition. 
It is a very nice addition. Oh my god, look at that. That's just so beautiful, isn't it? So beautiful. It's just the fact that, like, you don't have to hit an enemy for it to trigger. It just triggers. It maybe should be changed to, like, it, it can only trigger on hitting an enemy to make it a little less strong. Yeah, I kind of expected that. Good, good. This is depth two, so we want to find item room first here. Lost a bit of HP here and there, but nothing major. I like runs like this, though, where you can just, like, hold down fire. <laughs> Focus on your dodging. Haven't used the poops in ages. Just don't need them. Got taken out as well. I mean, the Celestial Crown was really the thing that, that set this thing ablaze. Bobby Bombs. I think literally useless as this guy. Um, apart from if we use uh, the bombs as in combat, but I just don't see myself really doing that. Pretty bad overall. But, you win some, you lose some. Not ideal there. Bosses are like the, the point where we have the most trouble, I think. We're not like setting off these ice chain reactions so the tier effects aren't as effective against them. But like, it's not like it's bad against bosses, it's just not quite as effective. It's all luck based as well, it depends on how many of these shotgun blasts we get. Sometimes we get loads, sometimes we don't. We're going light path here. Game keeps doing this bullshit where it gives me devil deals when I'm on angel path. Someone needs to make a mod that stops that bullshit from happening. Because it's very annoying when you're trying to go for mega Satan marks and it's just like, nah, you'll still get a devil deal anyways, even though you've clearly established you want to be on the angel deal path. Fuck off with your devil deals. I don't want them. Because this floor, I'm not going to get an angel deal now. Or it's going to give me the 12% devil deal chance, isn't it? Even worse. Oh my god. Killed almost all of them there, apart from one. Beautiful. It's just, there's so many things working in tandem here to make such a beautiful ensemble of, uh, like a symphony of just death. I love it when you get a run where tier detonator can actually be, like, legitimately used. Because it's one of those items that I find is mostly pretty useless. But there's some builds that you get every now and again where it just shines so much. I mean, this isn't actually even particularly one of them. Like, it's good, but it's nothing crazy. Ah, oh, that was stupid damage. Because it keeps ta they keep targeting the enemies that I can't goddamn kill. Yeah, I'm wasting a lot of shots on that dude. Cool. Right, stop shooting for now because we've got quite a ways to walk back, and I don't want to just lag the game like crazy. Good. We don't have to do hush or anything, which is nice. But yeah, I have a feeling that the game isn't going to allow us to do mega certain yet again. It's kind of like the game's power play. This room's a little bit annoying. Just the knockback is probably the worst thing we have in our build right now. It can be very distracting. That was a very bad hit right there. And sometimes the targeting's a bit fucked. It is, boss. Okay. Yeah, you can see the bosses can go a little slowly. But overall, it's pretty good. Depends on who it decides to target. One minute, I've got a very itchy hand. There you go. There you go. Nice. And we've got just you as well. Okay, boss time. How's this going to go? Not a great boss for this, to be honest. That was a very, very... Bad hit by me there. I just kind of stood there and took that. Okay, you're splitting now. 
Did I get hit again there? Damn, I think I did. Okay. No deal. Hopefully the angel deal comes our way in the next area, but I'm not convinced, I'll be honest. 42% chance that angel deals, so we'll see. Yeah, see, it, sometimes it just goes for the wrong thing. <laughs> this is this is so entertaining. <laughs> ah, fuck's sake. These are the sort of Isaac builds I long for that are just stupid. I haven't had the Celestial Crown in ages as well, so it's cool to see it again. Feels like one of those ones that just never shows up for me. Ooh, a library could be interesting here. Okay, this is going to be annoying with the little fella doing his thing. I think we got him. Yeah, right. Library, could you provide anything better for us? I mean, you could throw Ipecac into the mix, but I feel like that's a bad idea. Books um, now activate another random item. That's... Ipecac seems hella dangerous here. Oh yes, we can't be taking that. <laughs> we can't be taking that. That that's, that seems fun, but wait. I just exploded myself there? I didn't think I had Ipecac anymore. What the hell, game? Okay, all the wrong way here. What are we hoping for out of this arcade then? Lots of soul hearts. Little chest in there. Ah, god damn it. I don't know about this run anymore. Health isn't looking great. I'm gonna be peeved if I don't get that angel deal as well. Of course, none of these decided to jump up when we wanted them to. Looks like we're going the right way now, at least. <laughs> Wait until there's a ton of shots on one enemy, then detonating it all. It's just, yeah, uber satisfying. We're on 11 fire rate now? What happened? When did we get all this fire rate? I thought we were on, like, 6. <laughs> I mean, I'm not complaining, I'm just a bit confused. Ow. Dude. Getting hit way too much. Hoping that would be a higher font, sadly not. Okay, yeah, health is our primary concern right now. We really do not have a lot. It's looking stickier and stickier each day. Oh god. Oh god. Hey, here's the boss, finally. Okay, bugger off heart. Unfortunately, this is probably going to be a bit where we get hit a few times, because I'm not very good at dodging this new mum, you know. Yeah, I got hit there, and I don't even really know by what. Like, I just don't really know the attack patterns of this new one, because I normally kill it very, very quickly. We're gonna deal with this. Still really aren't very good at dodging this. Okay, cool. Angel deal, please. Angel deal, please. Angel deal, please. Game's a fucking joke. Why is there such a high bar barrier to entry that's based almost entirely on luck and not skill for getting the Mega Satan keys? Like, obviously getting, getting a deal in itself is skill-based, but getting an angel deal is complete fucking luck. There's nothing you can do to influence it, really. It's just bullshit. <laughs> If I go Angel Deal, I should be going Angel Deal. You shouldn't be giving me fucking Devil Deals. That's happened twice in two episodes now. Very frustrating. Oh, bollocks. I got stuck on something. 
Okay, this might be two episodes in a row where we don't get much of anything done, but... They happen sometimes. Look at that knockback, man. Hilarious. Right, just keep going. One hit off death. It is what it is. Tainted Blue Baby is just my problem child character. It's not even that much, he's like not really that much harder than any of the other characters, but for some reason, I just cannot do well as Tainted Blue Baby. I just get hit way more as him for some reason. Oh dude, this knockback is gonna get me, gonna get me hurt. Of course you're invincible for all of that, you little bitch. A soul heart. I have been renewed. Got a good night planned tonight. It's actually Halloween today. Um, it's October 31st. I'm going to a Mexican place for some tacos. So not very thematic, but very delicious. Excited. I, I have literally no idea if they're doing like a Halloween night there or anything. My friend was just like, I really want to try this place. Do you want to go? And I was like, hell yeah. Beautiful. Beautiful. As always. No death effects for any of you enemies. Ooh, soul hearts, soul hearts, soul hearts. That blue flies. That's not what I asked for at all. Okay. We're good. We're good? Yeah, we're good. I thought I got hit by a blue fire then. I kind of walked into it by accident, but apparently it just didn't actually land. Hey, thought that was a secret room. There's also a tinted rock back over there as well, so health is looking a little bit better. Beautiful. We are saying there's a chance. Ah, oh, what the hell was that? There you go. Ah, oh, you trapped me in your little bubble. But yeah, gotta love some tacos. Hopefully some margaritas and all that as well. It's all good. Okay. Freeze effects on any of those enemies. Dude, I can't believe I didn't get hit there. That guy got pushed right into me. These little ham, ham burn boys, quite beefy. Take quite a lot of damage. Probably not gonna be the little room, is it? But I'll try it anyways. Nah, that's a key. Change fingers for a little bit. I've been hurting my pinky by holding that one this entire time. Who'd have thought Euphoria would actually be so useful on this run? So Euphoria is just triggering the shotgun shot way more often. Okay. And it's boss time. Good old Isaac. Got hit straight away. I just can't see the enemy shots at all. It's a complete mystery to me at this point. I'm actually doing very little damage, to be honest. Like, my, my, my base damage is so bad. Oh, I got hit by another beam. Wow. I don't know how to dodge this. Okay, he just ran me over. Anyways, that's going to end it there. Tainted Blue Baby, yeah, like I said, he's just my problem child. If people have good advice to me as him or something. I don't even think I particularly play him wrong. I think what it is, is I think I'm not a massive fan of his mechanics and not having bombs. And I think that gets in my head and I dislike the character and therefore I dislike playing him. So therefore I just inherently do worse because I've tricked myself into thinking I'm going to be bad. I don't know. Either way, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next one.